So hi guys, welcome back to another video on AJ5. So as you can tell by the title, I'm going to be reviewing the new Samsung Galaxy S21, um, which is about to release uh, sometimes next year, early next year. And you may be wondering why has my video audio improved suddenly? That is because I'm using a new uh, um, a new microphone, which I got as a gift from one of my good friends who also has a youtube channel make sure you check him out i'll leave a link to his um, channel description down below but yeah if you check out my previous video you'll you'll know what microphone i'm using so yeah before we get into the video i just wanted to let you know why this sudden improvement with my audio quality but yeah uh, let's look at some news on the S, uh, s21 plus design arrives in Chinese silver this was posted today about nine hours ago as it said earlier so Samsung Galaxy S21 Plus render arrives in Chinese silver colorway we're not gonna watch this video now uh, but what we're gonna, we'll do is new S21 have renders have leaked the renders contain a number of design cues we've seen earlier leaks um, punch hole set off the camera which already exists in the S20 and S10 I believe um, but yeah, let's have a look. Let's get in, into the actual design. The render includes a reworked grey camera array, which occupies much of the phone's left corner. Wow, this looks a bit... Does it look weird? I don't know. Is that how it looks like? It's not official, it's not official yet, but... Um, let's go to a different site. It just doesn't have much information. Uh, we want to see the price, specs and leaks. So the Samsung Galaxy S21 is coming here's everything we know so far the S21 rumors have been picked up steam blah 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 let's have a look at some images actually first so what we'll do is go into Google and S21 let's have a look at some images first see how it looks so obviously not all of these pictures are not official yet but um, these are some leaks that people have, you know, designed. What's going on? What is going on? What happened? Okay. It's an ultra. We'll take the Note Twenty's best feature, but why there's so many pop-ups? But not how you think. It has been a long rumor that the S Twenty One Ultra will be the first non-Note branded headset to support the S Pen stylus. Uh, in my personally I don't really like when phones come with a like a little pen I don't know that's just how you know I, I don't I don't really like it that's more of like a tablet or an iPad something like that or a note that has a pen but a normal phone I believe shouldn't have a pen it just you know you should just you know just use it like a normal phone not like a tablet or anything like that so let's look for the most recent news two days ago six hours ago here we have Tom's guide let's see what Tom has to say about the meet the S, S21 chip ready to fight the iPhone 12 Qualcomm has unveiled the Snapdragon 888 its latest system on chip for 2021 Android flagship phones so uh, no please don't play where are the specs of the phone I saw this the other day I did do some research before um, I think it was this one here it's Tom's guide again Tom's doing a lot of research into this so the S20 series was launched apparently it might be called the S30 I saw that somewhere that the the new Samsung might be called the S30 which I think is, is not very it's not it's not really I don't think it would be a good idea to name it S30 because obviously yeah, the S20 came out this year so they might go in 10s, S30, 40, 50 which personally I think is stupid they should just go for the S21 uh, no thanks so in the seven seven $750 range and uh, obviously if I do get the S21 it will be the the ultra one not the normal one because obviously oh, they're, they're, here are the specs so they got the S21, S21 Plus and the S21 Ultra and here are the specification so obviously they're all going to be using the same software the CPU is also the same on all of them the rear camera let's have a look 
12 megapixel 12 megapixel main camera is going to be 12 12 and oh on the ultra as you can see here it's going to be 108 megapixel and the main one is the other ones are just 12 megapixel um connectivity pretty much the same on all of them colors uh, we're gonna have violet pink gray and white silver black and violet black and phantom silver i think most people are gonna go for the phantom silver because um what is phantom silver i think it's like a very shiny silver kind of color and the battery life obviously the bigger the phone and the more features the phone has the had the battery life so we've got 4000 4800 and 5000 but that doesn't mean that the ultra will last longer it's just got a higher battery uh because obviously it takes more battery because it's ultra and has more features and stuff like that so yeah let's have a look at the s21 design it may look very similar to the s20 based on the renders we've seen blah 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 s21 has a vertical camera stack that looks similar to the note 20 series and the front display is flat instead of curved the trade-off is that the bezels look a bit thicker on the s21 uh ice uni blah 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 any more useful information s21 camera okay s21 cameras are shaping up to largely similar to what we saw on the s20 but with some key upgrades to the most premium model let's have a look is that a little bend here or is it just a shadow well, i hate phones that have like that come it comes straight and then they have like a little bend here okay the camera i don't think that's the actual design i think it goes in a straight line three or four cameras on the s20 on ultra um whoa what the hell is this six camera samsung seems to be planning some even crazy ideas for the future phones but it's unlikely they'll come to the s21 okay so i think this is for future phones but not the s21 luckily because that just looks a bit over the top with six cameras on the back of the phone and okay let's have a look at the processor obviously we know that it's going to be a strap snapdragon 875 if qualcomm sticks to its number and conversions for new versions performance and early benchmarks uh two, 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 two. geek bench 5 score single core and we've got multi-core as well so obviously uh i think that's for the iphone uh i bionic equipped iphone 11 and the a14 tooting iphone 12 these benchmarks are also hint some disappointment for uk and european samsung phone fans i think it's lower than um, other places as mentioned above uh, including charger and headphones obviously apple didn't include a charger this year with the iphone 12 a bit stupid i think because obviously a, a lot of people are taking the mic out of um iphone that you know and when the iphone 20 comes out there's not going to be any phones in there for environment friendly whatever they, they want to you know name it apple drew that uh, blah 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 pen support does they have a pen support based on reporting no, however it's more likely that the phone will offer s pen support but not feature a whole stuff for the stylus it would be optional yeah i don't really like phones that come with a phone this is the one i'll most likely be getting which is the uh, galaxy s21 ultra the major difference between the s21 and the s21 ultra is the size i'm pretty sure it's not just the size it's the camera and everything else as well otherwise i'll just go for the normal one if there was not much difference what we want so these are the galaxy s21 will be fighting the iphone 12 by the time it is released and it will also face competition from the google pixel 5 um in my opinion i don't really look for, i don't really i'm not a google fan uh some not up an iphone either um, i stick I, I tend to stick with samsung the first phone i ever had was a samsung the slide one but i've been with samsung ever since I, i've never switched to iphone or any blackberry nokia nothing like that i've always been with samsung since day one this is my first phone until now i'm i am with samsung so big fan of samsung um except the s7 i guess or the s6 uh, they don't come with a memory card and that was when i was disappointed where i thought that from the uh, samsung s6 onwards they're not going to have a phone that accept memory cards but obviously after that the s8 and the s9 they did come with the memory card so that was a uh, big news for me personally and yeah so as you can see here uh, these are the previous pricings of the phones so i think the s21 ultra is going to be about one and a half grand because the s20 ultra 5g is 1.4k it starts from 1.4 that's in dollars by the way so in the uk it's probably 1.2 or one point just under 1.2 
and the uh, S21 Ultra I'm guessing it will go up to about 1.4 uh, pounds which is about 1.5 to 1.6 dollars uh, and yeah less bugs at launch uh, blah 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 and yeah that's pretty much it guys and what we'll do is just go through some pictures here uh, and yeah I mean I, I feel like this is what it could be it could look like so you got the S20, S20 Plus and then the S20, sorry, S21, S21 Plus and then the S21 Ultra. But yeah guys, that's pretty much it for today's video. So if you enjoyed today's video, make sure you leave a like, subscribe to my channel, comment down below what videos you guys want to see um, on this channel. And yeah, let me know how my audio, new audio, is, is it way better than my previous ones or is it same or how do you think it is personally i think it's amazing i did i've done a test just before recording this video and it was it was 100 times better than my old how i used to make my old videos but yeah check out tko442's channel as well uh, link in the description down below leave a like guys subscribe to my channel thank you for watching and make sure you share it with your friends and families and i'll catch you guys in my next video where i'll be reviewing something else thank you and take care and peace